So this next memory aid is to help you remember the six major causes for dyspnea. So they are the six P's, pulmonary bronchial constriction, possible foreign body, pulmonary embolism, pneumothorax, pump failure, and pneumonia. So uh, pulmonary bronchial con- constriction prevents the passage of air into the lungs, which contributes to dyspnea. Um, then possible foreign bodies, those can be trapped or lodged within the trachea, restricting airflow and causing this difficulty in breathing. Pulmonary embolisms can prevent complete oxygenation of the blood in the alveoli to, um, due to restricted blood flow. Uh, pneumothorax, as you may know, is a collapsed lung, and it prevents full expansion, resulting in oxygenation. These people are really going to be having a real tough time breathing. It's going to be pretty obvious. Uh, pump failure uh, refers to the heart not beating appropriately, and if the heart is not perfusing the lungs, then the lungs will be unable to oxygenate the blood, so then they're going to really have this difficulty breathing. Uh, Pneumonia also leads to poor ventilation as well. So those are the six major causes for dyspnea. Um, I'll go over them again. The six P's are pulmonary bronchial constriction, possible foreign body, a pulmonary embolism, a pneumothorax, pump failure, and pneumonia. This has been another episode of the Nursing Pneumonics Podcast by NRSNG.com with your host, Katie Kleber, RN, CCRN. To grab all of our nursing cheat sheets, head over to nrsng.com slash freebies. That's nrsng.com slash freebies. Thank you so much for being here today. We love you guys. We thank you so much. We want to see you guys succeed. Listen, we're all in this together. Now go out and be your best self today. Happy nursing.